All right, hello, and welcome to what I am calling Vlogs Given. Vlogs Given. I am filming for the week of Give Thanks Day or American Thanksgiving. Um, so come along. We are on our way to my mom's house to hang out. My dad is off today. He is a railroad guy, and he doesn't get off often. So whenever he summons the children, we all come. So... We're gonna go over there. I'm going to use my mother and dad's beautiful bathtub and take like a little bath. And I am so excited. So, come join me and let's see what we get into. Well, this bathroom is the best. Um, I didn't know the shower was on, so I had to turn it, you know, to bath. But yeah, took a bath and basically fell asleep in the bathtub until it was time for dinner. Um, and my dad somehow talked my mom into an impromptu Korean barbecue, barbecue, Korean barbecue hot pot situation. So that's what this is. And, uh, yeah, it was really delicious. And I feel like we all had a wonderful time. Okay, so it is the next day, and sorry, I'm introing. It's the next day. I'm talking to my sister because I talk every day. Um, so on today's agenda, I think I'm going to get done cleaning the playroom and Aiden's room. Do Aiden's closet. So Aiden's closet and the playroom. I'm trying to keep the bathroom cleaning closer to when it's time for Thanksgiving because I want it to be fresh. So, I'll probably do that on Wednesday morning before I start cooking. Um, also, today we are going to make some cookies. and have some cookies and eggnog. So, my sister may come over for cookies and eggnog. And we have to finish my Thanksgiving sweater. So, that's on the list. So, let's start the day. Horrible lighting. Let's start the day. All right, guys, so we are back home from my mom's house, spent some time with her. Um, now, I am about to either make the kids some food. Well, we kind of ate at my mom's house, but not a lot. But I'm going to make them some food, and I'm going to start baking cookies. So that way, we can have cookies and eggnog, and it is Dancing with the Stars night. It's the finale, so I'm going to do my best to watch the finale live. So, I'm going to make sure that everything's okay, and we're going to watch it live. I mean, if I, if I don't watch it live, I guess I'll just stay off the internet. And Well, if I don't watch it live, I'm going to try to like catch it like 
right after it ends so that way I can watch it live. Um, but, um, yeah, so let's make some cookies and get some dinner going. All right, guys, so it's a little bit later. Dancing with the Stars is over. Um, the little baby from TikTok won, and I mean, she really deserved it. So I wasn't upset. I mean, was I upset that Wayne Brady or Gabby didn't win a little, but she definitely deserved it. So um, I won't say too much because I be getting emotional. I guess I just be, I don't know. Everyone keeps saying that I'm an empath and that's why I keep crying and every time I watch stuff. So I'm going to let them have it <laughs> so we won't talk about it per se. So now it is time to get down to the nitty gritty. Basically, we are going to be chugging on this sweater, which I don't have a lot left. I have, um, I have some sh short rows I think I don't even know what these short rows are for or if they're gonna get done um, but has short rows to do and then I have the ribbing and then we have the, the collar and that's it so I've got some snacks kind of brewing I got some cookies here and I'm going to um, binge watch a little bit of a show while we try to get it done my goal is to get like 90%, like 95% done tonight. If I can just finish, yeah, I'll say that. If I can just finish the ribbing tonight, I'll call that a win. So I'm gonna take you on that journey with me. And um, yeah. Good morning. So it is the next day. I actually stayed up to like two in the morning. I finished my short rows and now I'm on my ribbing. Something strange is happening, so I really have to focus on that um, right now. I'm gonna get the kids some breakfast. And then um, on today's agenda, I really wanna finish, I really wanna finish my sweater. That's number one. Um, definitely wanna finish it by tonight in case I wanna block it. Um, I also wanna dye my hair today. Um, we'll see how that goes. I'm gonna try to make like a little transitional TikTok, so I hope it comes out okay. You know me. Uh, TikTok's hard. <laughs> I think I'm a way better YouTuber than TikToker. Uh, so, yeah. So that's on the agenda today. Hopefully I get more footage of me knitting. I didn't get a lot last night because I was watching Manifest on Netflix. Hashtag not sponsored, but hashtag could be. <laughs> Period. Um, but I was watching Manifest and it was getting too intense. Like, I think I put the knitting down a little bit because I was like, I can't do this and knit so uh, come along today lots of knitting lots of cute snacks and yeah and today we are starting the cooking process so I'm starting my sweet potato pies and my macaroni and cheese today and um, yeah cooking to that day um, it was pretty in a therapeutic mode. I literally put my headphones on because my husband was off. So he sat with the children. I put my headphones on, put them up loud. And I just got in the zone and did the things that I needed to do. So um, I think that 
they came out nicely. I knew I messed up, so I didn't make enough cheese sauce for the macaroni and cheese. And as you can see, this is a lot of noodle compared to the pan, basically. So I, um, yeah, this was a fail. But in the end, I was able to save it, and my macaroni and cheese was a hit, actually, on Thursday. So I was pretty excited. a taste tester chef and I am definitely a chef that cooks cooks that dances for the food so I feel like if you're not dancing for the food if you're not tasting it then where is the love like really so a lot of these clips are me <laughs> just cooking and dancing um there is a taste tester that comes in a little bit later to give their two cents which is appreciated as long as it's respectful so it was um yeah it was a journey but i got there Starting the sweet potato pies, which I learned uh, later on that one was sweeter than the other. So, yeah. Don't know how I did that. It just happens like that sometimes. Um, so, again, just singing and dancing to the food. And making sure it feels loved through my expression of dance and music. So, yeah.
someone else's turn to start cooking. So in the meantime, I caught some knitting in um, where I could. So my husband started on the cornbread dressing while I sat and watched, which was a lot of fun. And I think by this time, my brother-in-law came into the house and he usually stays over into you know tomorrow for thanksgiving so yeah morning of thanksgiving and my son decided to get into the bed with me that morning and then kick me and try to keep me up at night so i gave him my bedroom and i came into his bedroom and hid while i picked up the button band of my cardigan i think this is where i was a little upset with myself because it's like i was literally right there on the end i was literally on the button band and i don't finish the sweater until two days later um which upset me a little bit, but at the same time, I'm so proud of all the progress that I made, so I can't be too mad about it. Well, it was a lovely event on Thursday, um, which you're watching now is Saturday when I'm uh, binding off. So um, yeah, it was an amazing time and I'm so grateful for everything that happened and everything that came. Like I said, even though I didn't finish the sweater um, on Thanksgiving, I got 99% there and I'm proud of that progress. So if it takes me two days to bind off, hey, it's one by one ribbing and I think there were short rows in the ribbing. It was a lot happening. <laughs> so it's done though and I'm proud. So you can look out for the next podcast. That'll let you know um, what it looks like. So thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and press that notification bell. And I will see you very, very soon to start Vlogmas. Bye.